The next extension we'll add to our brackets text editor is called Emmet, and it easily earns the title of most popular extension because it allows us to expand simple abbreviations into complex code snippets, and by doing so, makes our life as coders much, much, much more easier. So let's go over here to our extension manager, and let's type Emmet. And you can see over here, it says high speed HTML and CSS workflow. So let's install. And now we have added Emmet to our brackets text editor. Now Emmet is a lot of information. So I'm not going to cover everything in this short video. However, I'm just going to cover some basics so you can see uh, how it is working and what, what are the benefits of it. So let's say I'm in uh, my text editor. And I want to create a div with unordered list. And let's say I want like have five uh, list items. So you know the typical way how you type it in HTML. However, Emmet allows you to do it much more quicker. So let's have a look. So let's say I wanted to create a div and then I wanted to create a unordered list and then I wanted to create a list items, right? So what Emmet allows me to do is I'm, I'm going to write the shortcut over here. And then I have over here, you can see that Emmet is already in my, in my bar over here. So I can either remember the shortcut, which is actually very easy. It's going to be tab, but I can also come here and expand abbreviation. So I click over here and you can see right away how my, how the Emmet so nicely uh, actually expanded whatever I needed to write. So I didn't have to spend much time doing so. Okay. So let's check the same thing with the tab. So I'm going to delete it over here. And in this case, I'm going to say that I want to make a unordered list and list. But let's say this time I'm going to multiply by six because I want to have six list items. So all I do is press tab and you can right away see what happens. That how quickly my work has become that I'm using Emmet right now. Now, like I said, I'm not going to be covering all the options because even by looking at it, you can see that there's a bunch of things that you can do. And I'm going to let you to go over them by yourself. However, uh, let's just have a look at a couple more things that we could do. So let's say I would want to add a three block elements, right? So I could just write that I want to add div, I want to add paragraph, and I want to add block code, right? And I just press tab. And right away, you can see I have three paragraphs here. With Emmet, I can also add a attribute uh, operators to my HTML. And what I would have to do is, let's say I would write div, and then I would use the number, and then I would write header. And let's, let's press tab, and you can right away see that I have created a div with ID of header. And I can do the same thing with class if I want. So in this case, I would write div, and instead of, uh, let's say, the ID header, I would actually create a class header. Okay, again, press tab, and you can see that I have uh, created a div with class of header. So now you can see that it has tons of tons of options that you can do and how it can make your life much, much more easier just by saving your time that you, you, that you would normally would have to spend on typing.